Is he gonna ride this bike all the way to LA? What? The package has blood? What? Somebody's head? Who you know who does it better than this? I'm the boy who done did it. I'm on top of the list. Trying to get a good signal like a satellite dish. Every day to me. It's like a solar eclipse. I What's up y'all, it's your boy Lee and I'm some coolest at Afghan Geek. Welcome to my channel, about to dive right into episode 12 of Lucifer Season 5 Part 2. Technically the fourth episode of the second part of Season 5. I'm mad excited. Uh, last episode was uh, interesting to say the least. To see God, like this human, feel pain, go through what <laughs> two brain freezes back to back <laughs> his knowledge of ella and everybody in lucifer's life his understanding of humanity and how he's been fucking up all this time i'm sure the christians are loving god are taking accountability <laughs> there were so many biblical references in the previous episode linda trixie everybody shined then and May's favorite characters right now in the second half of season five that is um of course lucifer is the main protagonist of course chloe is the main protagonist love interest <laughs> i didn't know how to describe her for a young second but i'm mad excited let's not waste any more time and dive right into this episode we're starting with dan Look how excited I am. Is that a, a Fast and Furious poster behind him? There's a problem in such a bachelor pad due to your dad. <laughs> he leaves posted notes for himself. Already love this episode. The roasting is different now. What am I supposed to anymore? <laughs> Like being teased by Genghis Khan or Darth Vader. <laughs> I'm not some bloody detective. The whole dynamic has changed. <laughs> right. Look, I'm sorry you're we do. This is the only show I'll let pass with the whole villain of the week type of situation. Yes, we were friends. Please make this a full on Dan episode. Who likes to be your friend? Even the way this episode is shot is interesting. I don't think he's got it all under control. Promise. It is a Dan episode. I'm so happy. <laughs> what the hell? Who directed this episode? This is such a weird episode, but I love it. Is he about to have a rager? Why do I feel like his friend is going to put him in some trouble? God damn, that's why he's panicking. What does that say about the universe? I just need a man. Dan, don't fall into it. Man, he blacked out. This dead body on top of him? Ah! Why is this shot like a telenovela? And I was clicking to me. Why? I thought it was an interesting choice. I knew he was going to get into trouble because of this guy. Man, I was excited for the Dan episode, but now it's feeling so filler episode like. <laughs> hey, it's that woman from Vida. The Stars Show. Is this like a backdoor pilot? <laughs> oh. Did they spray paint his face? Haha! <laughs> So he lost the witness and the package he was transporting? Who's that? What a weird episode. Driving back from show <laughs> Sky's room is improv class? God damn. Yeah, yeah. Forgot about that storyline. Like I'm all for a damn episode, but if it doesn't help the story, it's like the hell. It's gonna be a Dan and Lucifer team up? Ooh, something not legal. Is this episode made to mend their relationship? Yes. What? 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 Takes another level of 
bad guy to go to a location they normally hang out in after escaping prison. Why do they look like they're trying to threaten the customer? Now he's having a heart to heart with the criminals. I mean, it's great. It makes them seem more than one dimensional. Why do I feel like his dance friend lied to him? <laughs> this was the best distraction, man. Well, he's the devil. He can whip all your asses. Is he gonna ride this bike all the way to LA? What? The package has blood? What? Somebody's head? Damn, Daniel. That never gets a break, though. Why would Dan do it? This episode does not put... <laughs> What I meant to say does not put Dan in a good light. He's so bad at this. Why isn't he just Maybe honest with people? Bullcrud. <laughs> I actually do know. The, the murder. This episode oh, is the weirdest right. one thus far. So, Weirder than the musical one. Where did Lucifer go? Is he still fighting those people? But they didn't seem to want to fight back. They were scared of his eyes. You're gonna run, You're a big... man. They did my boy Dan dirty in this episode. She took his car. Oh, it's a middle deal. Listen, why did you call them if you can figure it out? I do. <laughs> you think gonna fly him a baby style? Yo. They did yeah, Dan so to... dirty this episode. It's about to be a Dan Mace team up, please. Oh, she's totally gonna laugh. Come on, <laughs> Thank you. Mace Dan team up. It means this has got to be one of the weirdest episodes so Lucifer's so ever made. You hide out on the balcony. It's like an Italian telenovela. <laughs> and I'm legit serious when I say that. You are, Mr. Then Linda pops out of nowhere. <laughs> she just said it. God damn, this episode is so weird. <laughs> Madeline, I guess this episode is too help Lucifer and Dan really mend their relationship. Oh, no, I'm, I'm not gonna be... Who is you, Lucifer bringing? Look this. All over it. This place, right? Ryan, what the hell Damn, it's improv group. They look like... <laughs> like the bad guys in like Greece or so Mafia for like... I never forgive uh, Lucifer for what they did to my boy Dan yeah. in this episode. Because I walk out of here out. <laughs> Man, this is a weird episode. This episode is filler like episode 150,000 level trillion. I don't even know what I just said. Why would they listen to him now? What? Did Ryan just die? What the hell is happening in this episode? A bunch of improv people just dying for no reason right now? Who the hell wrote this episode? Like legit, I'm gonna look up people's reactions to this episode and the music. I can't be the only one tripping at how weird these episodes are. Then they have good episodes in between. There's no way this episode is real. There's no way this episode is real now. It makes so much sense. <laughs> this is like a bad nightmare for him. Is this whole whole thing a play from Lucifer? What the hell is happening? Is this a prank? What the hell is the point of this episode? They're not going to explain why this happened. 
Make it make sense. I'm so confused. <laughs> it's just this is all. So they become friends again. They made us watch a whole hour of this. Was that a compliment from Lucifer? <laughs> oh yeah. What a callback. This whole episode was dead. So do we just spend the whole episode in Lucifer's mind? <laughs> How he operates in hell, essentially torturing somebody, but then optimistically pushing through it towards the end. Uh, like that moment I was like, they're killing so many innocent people. Maze is dying. No way, this shit is real. Oh my God, this was a weird episode. I don't know how I feel about it, honestly. There were some moments I was insane, some moments I was mad, confused, some moments I was bored as hell. <laughs> they did my boy Dan dirty in this episode, dog. <laughs> he acted so frantic, like Frank. I can't even find the words. He acted so lost and confused and. Discombobulated. <laughs> you guys saw that episode with me. I don't think I'm gonna end it today. I think I'm gonna watch Lucifer slowly this two episodes of the day. God damn, what a weird episode. What a weird this is definitely one for the books. I still need to process it. Like I said, I need to watch other people's reactions to this. To see how they reacted to it for me to get a handle on if I'm tripping or the show is the tripping portion of this scenario.